clever, the drop shot, and then the court positioning. At this level. Excuse me. <laughs> Super return. So often, as we were saying last week, Moschino will lose the first set in a match and win 11 times this year thus far. Mm, only just. Too good. Wild carded 18 year old. Yeah. Superb. Brilliant. And you mentioned the doubles, Joe. And full evidence there of all the skills. Very much so. A nice athletic leap at the end, but uh, she'd already made her mind up to come in and she knows where to move after she's made the approach shot. It's a great response from the return though, wasn't it? Because she was right out by the trams, Mosquina, after the serve. Yeah, you're going to see a lot of that. Gifted the break, three in a row now. And uh, Miskina, I hope you're not hearing on the court effects mics, not best pleased. <laughs> Yeah. 
the double fault, gifting the break again, four in a row now. Straight away after the double fault. Good response. Yes, I think she took some of her frustrations out there. It's a big miss, and that uh, really does just gift the break back. She's not happy at all. But 4-2, Lehovsova, the fifth break of serve in a row. Hmm. Too good. Beautifully measured. Just long, giving the 5-2 lead now for the 29-year-old. Just feel more tired than others. Yeah, very sharp up to the net. But overall, she always looks neat and tidy. Lost the point, Mosquina, but it was a much better second serve. Super play from Lehovsova, who really does look sprightly, doesn't she? By comparison, 40-15 to set point. She's done it. 6-2 the opening set, still hasn't held serve, the Russian number one and defending champion. First point, second set. A bit of luck always helps. there perhaps got it all wrong you now the leg cord not helping Lehovsova there and there is the break and then lost in the first round in Bali to Maria Elena Cameron of Italy in three sets of course she'll want to defend here but Take that. Super play.
Yeah, on the line. Tough game, but holds. Nothing you can do about that though, that's a super point from the 29 year old. Yeah, much better from the Russian number one. Well, there it is again from nowhere. It's extraordinary. <laughs> Suddenly, she can't stop hitting winners. Fabulous play. Miskina at her very, very best. Oh. Yes, four games ago, which we're making reference to, had two calls of out against Lehovsova, two balls that were clearly inside the baseline. a problem for the pair of them of course then puts pressure on the second percentage on second service points played Miskin she's won 12 of 29 that's 41 percent only half of the points won when her first serve goes in oh dear third double of the game Double bounce, but it's not been called. Well, it was called very, very late. Brilliant into a third set. There it is, the second set for Miss Skeener in about 26 minutes. <laughs> Fabulous. Lehovsova almost came to a standstill <laughs> at the end of that point, but what a point it was. Yes. This match in the bottom half of the draw, incidentally, the winner will play the six seed Russian Vera Zvonareva.
And then, of course, the winner of that will play either Schiavone or Lindsay Davenport. And you would assume that would be the number one player in the world, Davenport, who she doesn't enjoy playing and lost to last week. I think every tournament is tough at the moment. Absolutely brilliant. So many Russians in the draw. Who do they yes. clap for and support? <laughs> That's fantastic. Fabulous. Almost like a carbon copy, wasn't it? You can get up and it's hard to get going and, you know, this is one of those days for Anastasia. Just! It sort of clawed its way over the net, didn't it? Out the let calls have favoured the number one Russian. Quite amazing. Set down last week in Fildestadt to Lehovsova. One love and two after that. And here we are. Lost the first set here in Moscow. And is now 6-1, 5 love. A game away from the quarterfinals. Now just the one. Fifth double fault for Lehovsova. Gives the defending champion three match points. 
There it is. Seven breaks of serve in a row for Miskina. Not the best way to treat your friend, is it? A little consoling smile as uh, she concedes just one game after the loss of the first set. The defending champion took a while to get going, but then when she got going, it was a joy to watch. Yes, it was. And uh, she, as you say, Chris, she's got a tough draw, but. I don't know, wouldn't cunt her out of uh, winning this tournament again. In the defending champion here, the first lady 12 months ago to lift the Kremlin Cup from the home country. And there'll be many that would say she's going to be very, very tough to beat this week. Lindsay Davenport will have a thing to say about that, of course, as the number one in the world again, Lindsay Davenport, coming through earlier today again. One o'clock Central European time. Four o'clock this afternoon. British time and five o'clock CET. Simon Reid again will be in Vienna for the CA Tennis Trophy. So we hope to have your company later on for that. And a bit of fun as usual. <laughs> yes, at the end and very enthusiastic. Try and get <laughs> these tennis balls. It's quite funny, those ladies there in, in the background, Moschina was aiming the ball over their heads and one of them ducked when she hit it. <laughs> <laughs> the first one. I don't think she's that bad a name. <laughs> nice feeling walking off, having just won her 12th match of the year from a set down. That is prolific and by far the best on the WTA Tour in terms of comebacks. Congratulations to the defending champion, 23-year-old Anastasia Miskina. She lives to fight on another day. Thanks for your company today. From Joe Jury and me, Chris Bradnam. We'll see you tomorrow, same time. Until then, a very goodbye for now.